So here's the aftermath. Uh, it went pretty well. This thing was uh, pretty much um, full of honey, almost the whole thing. Very few brood. And as you can see down there with the cardboard, there's just loads of, uh, of uh, nurse bees. But we did sweep quite a bit of them back up into the uh, original beehive. This is uh, the pile of honeycomb that I'm not putting in the, the beehive. Uh, quite a bit of bees all over the place and honey's just dripping everywhere. I'm just going to leave that for the bees to clean up. The uh, original box is touching the uh, nook box. So eventually the nurse bees can just crawl over and uh, find their way into the entrance of this box. Now here is the drawback, excuse the camera, of moving a beehive is you can see the bees clinging to where they originally were and this is only about eight to ten feet away and I'm not I'm not worried about it I'm just gonna let this be and eventually they will make their way over here to this box here and as you can see doing a beehive removal is a mess anyways that's about it how did these other two beehives uh, do? They did well. They stayed put, didn't interfere, and it's fixing to rain probably in the next hour or so. There's a lot of bees flying around, so I'm uh, shutting her off. Well, it was a success, and there's more bees in here than I realized, and there's a lot of nurse bees. Wasn't too much brood, so um, we'll. Uh, check back uh, tonight and see how everything goes and hopefully the majority did find their way into the entrance uh, we did not spot the queen there's too many bees and too many nurse bees so nurse bees mean that the queen is healthy and she's laying anyways uh, that's it